Good morning. What you see sitting here is plantain. I went out this morning and I wanted to pick about three cups and I've washed it off, but I haven't measured it yet, so I'm not sure exactly how much I have. But plantain um, grows wild. Looks like this. This is an arrow leaf. But there is also a wide leaf. And both are safe to consume. And I pick some flowering. This comes up from the center of the plant. Obviously, starts like this. Ends up about this tall. And then this is flowered and this is where all your seeds are. Hope you can see that. I think so. Um, so it's, it's really easy to identify that. Plantain is like nature's band-aid. Um, you do have, to, of course, to make sure you don't have allergies to it because some people do. I'm going to mix it with some honey and I'm going to use it for a sore throat. Um, they were asphalting outside my window yesterday and my my throat feels absolutely burnt from the noxious fumes. Noxious. There you go. That were coming in the window. My throat is really sore and tea is just not really cutting it this morning. So I'm going to go ahead and do this and Plantain is, is edible. Um, I may make a video, maybe more on it later, but I'm sure there are already so many out there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run this through my food processor. And what I'm looking for is one cup of plantain juice. And then I'm instead of just throwing the leftovers away, I'm still going to go ahead and put them on my dehydrator. Um... I'll mix it in with some other teas and hopefully draw out a little bit more of the properties of it once it's dried. So I will be back. Okay, ideally what you want to do is after you get these leaves chopped up, you want to squeeze them and normally they give juice. They weren't giving it up to me today. This is what they look like. They're just pulverized. Um, so what I did was I just added some water in and I put them on, on the stove and I just let it simmer. I, I didn't let it get very hot, just a simmer until the plantain released its juice. Very green. Now what I'm going to do is to... I'm only doing a half recipe. Um, hopefully this won't be a, an everyday occurrence, but honey's going to store anyway, so I'm really not worried about it. I have a half a cup of plantain juice to a half a cup of honey. And get this out of here. Oh, the smell yesterday was just so bad. Ugh. Mix the honey into it. And, the, and you know, it is still warm because I did simmer it, so it is still warm. And then all I'm going to do is pour it in a bottle. I'm going to keep it in a dark place. And, um, got my bottle ready. By the way, let me move this. This was actually really good. It's pure leaf tea, but it's, uh, wild blackberry and sage. So for anybody who's got access to both of those, if you haven't tried it as a mix together, you might want to do so. It actually has a very, very pleasant flavor. So there you go. I'm just going to Reuse my glass jar. I don't care if a little bit of the plantain is floating in there. It doesn't bother me in the slightest. Because it is very edible. Get this out. And there you go. And I am going to take about a tablespoon of this right now. And um, throughout the day as I need it. Okay. That's it for today. You'll have a wonderful day. God bless you.